Isn't this relaxing? Isn't this nice? A big hello. Welcome to the chill stream for this evening. Life is strange. I've been waiting to play this. I've been waiting for a long time. I know it's been out for like 50 years. But hey, I'm just getting to Legion, so give me a break. It is 11.55 p.m. Whoa, what is that? It is the shares. Wow, what an epic entrance. <laughs> hello to you Shazology a big hello hello Steph good to see you there uh, who else we've got Alicia hello to you a Brookhalian hello to you and of course Shiv uh, stopped by to say g'day as well before she went back to work lovely to see you all um, thank you so much for the hosts there Conchita Papita with the auto host thank you so much and Turtle Dragon 81 with the host as well you know what I have to say to you guys right Thank you. Thank you. This is my Portal 1 turret. 
Thank you so much. Shazology, what's up? How are things in Singapore? You know, if you still got that super hot weather, we've got ridiculously hot weather here in Melbourne. And like I say, it's 11.55 p.m. on Saturday. Uh, so it's about to be Sunday. Gosh, today went fast. But it is about 35 degrees and it's midnight and it's that really horrible, humid, hot wind. Uh, and I'm, oh my God, I'm just so exhausted. I'm so tired by it. It's ridiculous. Anyway, good to see you guys here. Um, should check out my cry command. Oh, oh yeah, well, let me do it. Let me do it for you. This is now um, Steph's catch cry, literally. You ready? Now, that is a true life recording of uh, Steph after I've sung happy birthday. Uh, so she was kind enough to send that to me. Uh, so thank you very much, Steph. Um, Brooke Halian um, says, um, I bought Life is Strange a while ago. Yes, same here, right? I never got around to playing it, so I'm curious to hear what you think of it. Well, good. So am I, Brooke Halian. So am I. Uh, in fact, do you know what's crazy? I've got it here on the PC, and we're playing the PC version tonight. I also have the full uh, season on PS4, and I think season one and two on Xbox. I, I, it's just terrible, absolutely terrible. Uh, I, I should play it because I own it that many times, right? Crazy. Um, hello there, Starhawk Ranger. Lovely to see you. In fact, hello to see, uh, sorry, hello to everyone uh, today. It's Conchita Pepepa. Whoa, -ho -ho. good to see you. And thank you again for the host, by the hello. way. Hello, hello. Um, how long do you have before fall, Sambo? Um, now that's your autumn, isn't it? I think that's what you call autumn. It is uh, autumn now. So it was the 1st of March and it's now the 17th. So technically we're out of summer. And this is the thing, right? It's still crazy hot here. It's ridiculously hot. Um, and of course, that, you know, we're not messing with the environment or anything, are we? No, no, we're not. Yeah, it's absolutely crazy. Um, yeah, so anyhow, uh, real shocker. I've never played this before. It looks amazing. We're listening to the soundtrack in the background there. It's, uh, I've got the game muted, actually. And the reason that I've got the game muted is because this is another one of those games that when you lose focus, it doesn't pause, but it loses its audio. And it's really jarring and horrible. And I've been researching for about an hour trying to find out uh, if you can fix that. And there is a command in the any file which says, hey, uh, don't pause it if you lose focus. And that's cool because it was pausing. But unfortunately, the sound still cuts out. So uh, once we get going, I may not be quite as interactive in chat. So I'm going to have to leave it up to you guys to do the appropriate sound effects. Now, by now, you should know me well enough. You know when we have to do a thank you, when we have to do a best, uh, when it's appropriate to do a yeah, baby, or a cry, or anything like that. Um, come on, you guys are expert at this, right? So I'm counting on you lot. Um, yeah, you don't start calling off until November here. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's... um. Yeah, it's just super hot. It's unusual and it's not normal. So yeah. Um, so uh, this is of course the best. You guys know that you're the very best. And if you'd like to see what is available to you to troll the stream, just have a look underneath. You'll see all of those commands there. So I'm going to try and stay focused on the game as much as possible. Uh, if we trigger an alert, I'll have to uh, lose focus and check that, unfortunately. So please forgive me if any audio cuts out or anything like that. It's just that it loses focus. But with that said, I'm really excited. And I mean, even the even the beginning of this is awesome. Like, if you look at this, if I go back. Uh, in fact, let's actually switch to game sound now. Hang on, let me uh, unmute it. Uh, here we go. Oh, there we are. It's beautiful, that is, isn't it? Right, there we go. All right, so if we go back here, this is the main... Oh, hang on, I don't have to bring you lot back up. I've lost you lot. And see what I mean? See, I've just I've just moused off it, and it's lost its focus. It's so funny. Um, so this is the title screen. Even this here with the music is awesome. I mean, I'm looking at this going, oh, wow, look at the graphic style. It's actually sort of um, painterly, semi-realistic. Hello. Hello. Hello there, Eldred. Good to see you, my friend. Thank you for popping along. Lovely to see all of you guys for our chill stream tonight. I don't know where this is set. I presume it's a fictional town, but I don't know what, you know, region it's based on in the US. I don't know if it's like a Canada or an Oregon or a California, maybe it looks like a bit. I'm not sure. If you guys know anything about this and if you guys know any tidbits as we play through 
uh, the opening scenes of this, then please let me know. Don't be shy. And like I say, back seating's okay. Spoilers are okay. Everything's okay. Uh, we just want to enjoy the game and uh, have a fun and informational uh, stream. And of course, spoiler alert to everybody, I guess. But I mean, the game's been out for, for what, two and a half years or more. So I think if uh, we're spoiling anything tonight, it's tough, basically. Got it all excited seeing those Swotor pictures on Twitter, Sambo. Says Rob Zob. Hello to you, buddy. Hello, hello. Can I get a hello? Can I get a hello in the uh, chat, please? Hello to you. Uh, I've just spent the last hour and a half playing Swotor, yes. And guess what we're going to be streaming tomorrow? We're streaming a Swotor. I'm going to make a brand new Jedi Sage. And we're going to play through the opening uh, because uh, it looks really cool. So yes, you've got every reason to be excited, Rob Zob. And that was super fun. And I've got you guys to blame for that. You guys have um, led me in some crazy gaming directions recently. Yep. Uh, but, uh, hey, we're a variety channel, right? So, Hello. thank you so much, Eldred. Thank you. My, uh, You guys can be my music directors, just like the doc, Dr. Disrespect, uh, off camera, my music directors, my show directors. Thank you very much. Um, so here we go. Uh, this, of course, is a fantastic game. It was an indie game. Uh, it comes out with five episodes, I believe. Um, and of course they've just released the most recent version of it as well which is a prequel, a three episode prequel to the oh, events yes. Oh yes, Starhawk Ranger There you go, you're getting off to a good start, thank you um, No, keep him up, keep up the trolling, I like it and uh, like I say, whenever ever anything's appropriate you've got hundreds of uh, sound effects, not hundreds but you've got dozens of sound effects down there to play with so use them for sure um, but this, by all means, is an amazing game. It's got one of the highest scores on Metacritic, um, and uh, I just can't wait to get into it. And apparently the story is amazing. I know a lot of you guys have played it, but I haven't. So I hope you enjoy my reactions to the game uh, as we play through it. And it just looks fabulous so far. So well, let's get on with it, shall we? Save game one, and uh, just make sure I've got all the sounds and everything turned up. Uh, video settings, what do we got here? Advanced video, what's all this? Yes, yes, hi, hi, hi. I like the sound of that. That's good. Um, the audio. Everything up full. Now, if the game's too loud or too quiet, please, you'll let me know, won't you guys? You're very good like that. Um, but sometimes I love the game so loud that it drowns me out. Uh, we don't want that to happen. Uh, language and subtitles. We've got subtitles on. I assume you guys would like the subtitles. Um, I'm not going to put on the opaque background because I think that's a bit jarring. Um, and I think between the words and the audio, you should be able to figure out what's being said. Controls in this game are pretty easy, uh, from what I can tell. WASD is all, as always. Um, shift to jog, or fast rewind. Rewind is the right mouse button. Skip a cutscene is space, we won't be doing that much. Um, escape is pause. Tab for the journal, nice and easy. Interact with the left mouse button. Reset with the click, click of the middle. And uh, quick rewind is control. That's the, that's the one I'll probably forget. Um, that you can quickly rewind. I'll probably use right mouse button more. Uh, and tab being the journal. Well, I think without further ado, guys, it's time for us to start up a new game. What do you say? Very excited. Life is Strange is a story-based um, game that features player choice. The consequence of all of your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Very cool, and of course I've already got control of the character seamlessly. And on a dark stormy night, Starhawk Ranger, you're absolutely right. Now I know this is a loud scene, because it's got thunder and lightning and stuff, so if it's a little bit loud, we'll let it be loud. 
see what happens once we get into the game proper. So I'll let it be loud for now. I won't be doing too much talking. Lighthouse. Okay, I can hold shift. Controls seem very responsive so far. Beautiful soundtrack. Is it a spooker? I don't think so. I don't think it's a spooky game, no. There's some supernatural stuff in it, but it's not spooky. It's more edgy. Come on, Max. You can make it. Okay, that map says Arcadia Bay. Let's have a look at uh, settings. Hang on, audio. We'll just knock it down a little. But I do want to put it back uh, up once we get into the school. Didn't make that much of a difference, did it? <laughs> anyway. What is going on? It's one hell of a storm, folks. And there's Arcadia Bay, which I think is our home. Surreal. Famously called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you oh, go, Victoria. That was weird. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? How's the volume, guys? And nice frankly, and loud. It's Still hear me shh, okay? Shh, shh. Keep that to yourself. An emotional visual novel? Seriously, though. Nice one, Ildred. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of... Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. That's cool. I think that's a cool picture. What do you guys reckon? Desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. She had a brilliant now, what eye. I'm doing, by the way, is when so, I hold down left mouse button, taken sometimes approach. you get multiple options. I have to admit, my little I'm camera bag is battered, but still kicking. I prefer Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. I do love my analog camera. Of post -war I should take a quick picture now. And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the air, but a beauty in the That's struggle. right, just like you. You don't have beauty without a beat, which explains why Frank was Kerouac's photographic muse, and both were the great. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. <laughs> and Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't resist. <laughs> the point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Nice work, now, Max, Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits? Uh, no problem, Steph. No problem. Switch to your phone. Um, um, you're asking me? What? You're asking me? L let me think. Um. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. 
Can I get a burn? Can we get a burn? The Daguerrean process Good brought Lord. out fine detail in people's I spaces. haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Wait, there's a journal in this game? The first American Daguerreotype self journal? You know how much I love journals, right? If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Oh man, look at this. This is awesome. This is awesome. What? Page 8 of 8. October 1, my favorite month. The best weather of the year. I love watching... <laughs> Thank you for the sick burn, Ildred. Thank you. <laughs> I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames, but it's still too damn hot. Thanks, Global. What? <gasps> That's a bit spooky. Can we get an Illuminati, please? <clears throat> because before we started this game, was I not just saying how too damn hot it was and that we're not messing up the planet? Come on, guys. That's an Illuminati right there, surely. Um, but I can't bust out the big coats and sweaters or scary movies yet. Soon Kate will let me borrow The October Country by Ray Bradbury. Well, so they're talking about real things. Haven't much, uh, read much by him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my geek cred before I held up my copy of Battle Royale. Awesome. But he nails the autumn atmosphere of small towns. Uh, oh, this is on cooldown. 12 seconds. Damn. Damn. That's all right. We can wait 12 seconds. We can wait. The last time I wrote, uh, wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. I should find a Halloween party. At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy. As my parents love telling me on a loop, you have all the time in the world. Look at all these cool things, the postcards and stuff. Um, page one of eight. I got accepted into Black... We won't read all this, but got accepted into Blackwell Academy. I guess that's where I am now. This is it. I'm leaving Seattle, so she's from Seattle, to go back to Arcadia Bay, which is where we are now. Haven't lived there for five years, but it has one of the uh, best... No, out of all the best photography programs in the world, I choose to go to the smallest back in a town I was once excited about leaving. Uh, but this is important, I think. Maybe I wanted to come back all along just to see if Chloe and I are still even friends. But I do wish Chloe could have moved with us to Seattle. That city was made for her. So, Seattle wasn't like a fable, au contraire. Uh, so maybe Arcadia Bay will actually turn out to be the island of treasure and adventure I've been looking for. Shit is crazy here. Didn't realize how much crap I had to pack until I had to pack all my crap. <laughs> oh, funny. Um, caught my mum crying when she was packing my shirts. Nobody will know, uh, except for Chloe. So I guess she's wanting to meet up with her old friend Chloe. These are cool journal entries, aren't they? I love the hand, uh, handmade nature of it all. It's so cool. Uh, I'm a bit trying to get settled into a new school in social steen after getting used to Seattle. But I'm here now. This is the start of my new life. Sweet dreams. Oh dear. And then the next day, Blackwell sucks ass. I told myself not to whine so soon, but damn. The day started like Christmas morning. How could I forget Victoria Chase? Oh, that must be that woman in the Hello. classroom, right? Hello! Rich, stylish, entitled. I could feel instant judgment when she looked at my raggedy-ass clothes. Yeah, she did seem like a, a excuse me bitch. Hello, Taryn. Good to see you. And thank you for the hello, Ildred. Awesome musical director. Um, I kind of overslept after finishing playing WoW well at 5.30 a.m. Good Lord, man. Good Lord. That's crazy, but good. That's what the weekends are for, buddy. Friday nights, who cares? We've only just started. Ah! <laughs> Alicia, you've been uh, you've been demoted to sound assistant rather than uh, sound director. Uh, you report into Ildred. <laughs> um, we've only just started um, telling. Literally just started. We're just having our first day in school now. Uh, more to tell. Just, just having a um, quick skim through this. Ask load of homework. Uh, research famous photographers. Some of my homework. Mr. Jefferson assigned us a ton of reading. This is actually what I want to study. Jefferson is super cool and super chill. Yeah, baby. Super cool. Super chill. Uh, oh, I'm doing a chair dance. Okay, Ildred, you've been demoted as well. <laughs> See, Mr. Jefferson wouldn't play that because he doesn't try to be too hip. He just says what he thinks and expects us to as well, which is pretty cool for a teacher, if you like. Uh, I think he's genius. Oh, my God. I, like, totally want to marry him. Just joking. Just joking. 
Homework is kicking my ass. Um, the bros here aren't that different. Nathan Prescott, Prescott is Victoria's male clone with way more money and attitude. His family is the oldest in Arcadia Bay. Okay, so an old school um, banking family. Right, so we get it. So there's some real snobby folk here. Um, yesterday during class, he put his feet on the desk, started texting, and the teacher didn't say Jack. I would get suspended, but him and Victoria are part of this silly elite vortex club yeah. that puts on popular parties, and so they get their way. I guess it's good to be the king and queen. Haven't we all had that at school, guys? Right? Do you remember back to the days of that? Yeah, I remember. Uh, I don't want to slam everybody. I do like Kate Marsh. She's down the hall and in one of my classes. She's so pretty and sweet and friendly makes her more beautiful than the biatches here like Victoria who think beauty is just in your face and outfit. Whoops, already playing their drama games. Uh, finally had a chance to take some photos around campus, a competition, winner gets a trip to San Fran and lots of publicity. A couple of weeks before the deadline in October. Um, I don't know whether to love or hate it here. I'm trying to keep up with my science class. Too bad I can't clone and... Uh, Good thing I know Warren. Too bad I can't clone him to take my place in class. Mr. Grant is much cooler than the class. She, oh, Ms. Grant, sorry. She explains particle physics so even boneheads, bonehead, like me, can understand. Uh, I can even tell she's committed and passionate about life. Uh, life. It's cool. All right, so what do we got here? I guess this is um, dossiers about everybody. So this is us. My name is Max, and that's who we're playing, which is cool. Uh, we've got Mr. Jefferson, of course, who's a bit of a hottie. Can be a bit condescending, but he's pretty hip for his age. Kind of aloof and sometimes pretentious. Um, I love these journal entries. Oh my god, why can't more games have these journal entries? Uh, here's Kate. I've forgotten if I've ever seen Kate Marsh smile or laugh in the past month. She's really sweet and nice, but all the other students make fun of her. And she thinks that bullying has... Um, probably worn her down although she's an adult i bet she's not allowed to watch r-rated films and look here's the super bitch then there's victoria chase the elite of brackwell academy and a, like a total bitch and i hate saying that i just don't know why somebody who's so rich and beautiful needs to be so fucking mean 18 year olds at a pre pretentious a prestigious probably more pretentious academy should be evolving into artists and scholars not reality show contestants she also has an eye for the teacher heart for teacher which is so obvious that i'm like totally embarrassed for her um here's my photos i guess this is the photo that i took oh and do we have to i think this is like a, a scrapbook that we have to actually uh fill these in i'm pretty sure we're playing episode one called chrysalis and these are unlocks and these are the texts on my phone have a very special 18th birthday you're an adult now but still a little girl uh, check your account don't blow it all at once cool we like that um, oh here's Kate hey Max you around always did you want to go to tea later today absolutely all right, so she seems nice there's mom happy birthday and here's Warren make sure you check necromantic on my flash drive Wait, I have to study for a physics test. So if we bust anything, we have to measure its velocity. Okay, he seems kind of cool. Like a nerdy cool, you know what I mean? All right. You can find out all about him in your textbook. Or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <laughs> Man, I wish my teachers were like him. That's cool. Oh, now we're able to walk around. Whoa, okay. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Mm. Damn, they have carbon fiber tripods here. The ball head even has a pan lock. God, I think, I'm such a photo. I was going to say, man, I don't know that. You have to be a photo nerd, right? That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. Even though I didn't want to be in the picture at all, it was fairly fucking cool to watch him at work framing us. Can one of you guys remind me, is this Ashley? Is the voice actress Ashley? As in, hey Ash, what you're playing? Or am I confusing games? Because I know she's Aloy, but is this also Ashley? Birch? I love seeing Mr. Jefferson's awesome photos on these magazine covers. Ildred says he's not my kind of teacher, to be honest. Really? 
I had really straight, straight um, humorless teachers when I was growing up. I would love to have had a sarcastic and intelligent teacher myself, personally. Pop Vine is grunge dead. Oh, so you can actually read what these say. Ten reasons to get electronic mail. What? When is this set? Good lord. Illuminati. Um, oh, you think she voices Chloe? I know she's in this game, right? Took you long enough for the Illuminati. Good lord, Eldred. <laughs> but thank you. That printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. I could pump out a whole gallery show with that thing. When I don't suck. Someday. Obviously Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Like totally bank? Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Hmm. Uh, I just noticed over here there were some notebooks and stuff. I think we should have a look, right? Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Of course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Whoa, look at the price of that. $5,299 for a camera. Ow, damn son, damn. Uh, did we look at that one? So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. Gives me hope. This is definitely where cameras go to heaven. <laughs> oh man, they have those sweet ultrasonic lenses. And look at that vintage rangefinder. What? <laughs> what? She is such a photo nerd, isn't she? Hey, Kate. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. You got demoted, and the Illuminati was for my previous comment. Oh, oh, I see. All right, you, you both, you and Alicia can be, uh, you can have promotions, no problem. Hi, Kate. Oh, hi, Max. Kate, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Sure. She seems cool. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. Purge. Oh yeah, Purge. Dear Kate, we love your porn video. Blackwell Academy. Ah, oh, the poor woman. So they're trolling her, I suppose. Maybe we can see out the window. I like this panoramic view of Blackwell. Everything looks so green and serene. I like this game's art style. It's very cool. Huh. This might make a cool shot. Hey, let's take a shot. Does that mean it's in my journal? Yes. Ah, so we're having to feel... Okay, so I guess... Hmm... I guess we have to look out for these things, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I say there's ten of them. Yeah. Okay. So make sure you guys tell me if you stumble across any of these. So I'm guessing the next thing we look for is what's that? A broken skateboard? Uh, maybe a bust? Uh, a squirrel on a cola can? And it looks like bunks in a bedroom. You know what I mean? Like a kid's bedroom with a bunk stair ladder thing. I think. I think. Oh, wow. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we're in the prologue. Then we've got episode one, two, three, four, five. I'm guessing. I'm guessing. All right. Let's see if we can go and talk to these guys. Who are you? Every time I look at Victoria, oh. I feel like she's talking smack about me. She's a mole. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. All right, we'll speak to him. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, 
Do I have to? Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Well. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. But I still dig my little instant camera. I like instant cameras too. Like the one she's got. Would you guys, yourselves, would you own a Polaroid like that? Or one of those little Fuji snap Polaroids that you can get these days? What do you think of them? You can never escape the lighthouse here. Hmm, I wonder if that's significant somehow. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Hmm. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Plasma. I think it must be a few years old then when this is set. Uh, Starhawk says, I used to have one uh, many moons ago. Yeah, same here. I actually had a Polaroid one uh, with the rainbow Polaroid logo on it, you know. I loved them, loved them. But the blimmin' film is so expensive. It's ridiculous. So now you get those little Fuji ones, right? You know what I mean? Like the Fuji Snapmatics or whatever they're called that print the little stickers. Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. Are you an everyday hero? Of course we are, right? So cool that we can check these out anytime. The Decisive Moment by Henri Cartier-Bresson? That's rare. Annie Leibovitz, mad respect. The amazing Eugene Smith? Good to see Avedon among the masters. Golly, of course. Lots of people I haven't heard of yet. I guess that's why I'm here. Um, Alicia says, yeah, Polaroids are neat, aren't they? They're neat fun. And I like the fact that they're sort of a bit funky. You know, like the actual picture quality is a bit weird. Um, sort of over oversaturated and what have you. Uh, Talon says, I've got an old camera with a concertina front that my dad gave me. I know exactly what you mean. I used to have one that my dad gave me too, so I know exactly what you mean. Uh, and you can, you can squeeze it in like an accordion to fold it away. And then when you want to take a picture, you unlatch the front and it um, basically unexpands. I don't know what the right word for it is. Unconcertinas out. Uh, and there's a whole bunch of metal rings on the end of it for the lens settings and Another aperture and whatever. Another daily fail in front of the world. Uh, so yeah, I know exactly what you mean. Now what are those Fuji ones though? You can get them here for about a hundred bucks and the film's really expensive, but they make those little stickers and films, uh, Polaroids that you can put in your wallet and give to people. Really cool, really cool idea. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have to pass you always Welcome to the real world. Just cute? Hot. Then I might send you a special picture in because Max wants everybody to see how she is. I'm not paying Would you place it so short? I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. Well, what a neat way to do the intro for a game. She's so fucking shy. Wow, that's really stylish. That's super classy. Put the uh, earbuds in, of course, and that's the theme music and the credits. To all of you, wow. American girls, it's sad to Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. American girls yeah, this sounds amazing, like Alicia. Great indie looking music. I hate having everybody see inside my locker. Driving a car I love that picture of mom and dad. 
Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous. That's Jack Andy. Kerouac and Andy Warhol. That's freaking cool. Bully free me. Yes, this poster must stop bullies dead in their tracks. <laughs> I presume we didn't have to go backwards, right? Yeah, let's double check. To all of you, American Ah, the science room. Here's the portal to Warren's brain. <laughs> There's Taylor, always waiting for Victoria. I think that's Courtney. She's such a slave to Taylor and Victoria. Very cool music. I need a serious time out in the bathroom after that curry last night, right? <laughs> Tell them, yeah. By the way, she's looking around. Gosh, it's neat. Oh, I'm, I'm in love with this already. That's Dana talking to... I think his name is Justin. Whoops. Dana is on my floor, too. She's such an archetypal, gorgeous cheerleader. They must make them in a factory. <laughs> Stella is always deep in her nose. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. I cry sometimes, walking around. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Oh, it, Nightbot got you there, Starhawk. That's okay. Uh, she says she looks like a hooker. I can't. Uh, I can't allow you though. As in, I, I can't get to you. Are there any other mods that can allow that from Starhawk, please? Poor Daniel. He's so nice. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. Oh no, are they beating up? Logan's beating up on him. I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. What a jerk, don't you hate that at school? I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. She looks awesome. I like her look. She looks like really cool and nerdy. Um, Starhawk, I don't know. It must be on a list, I guess. Uh, I've just got the default bad word catcher on, so don't worry about it though, like you're not, it's, it's not you, it's just, uh, hang on, now that the music stopped, let me um, alt tab and allow that for you, make sure that you don't get timed out or anything, there we go, I don't know, maybe, maybe, we don't mind it. I wish October would last forever. Halloween party, missing person. It looks like she's been gone for months. Rachel Amber, missing from Arcadia Bay. Oh, so it's set in 2013. Okay, that makes sense then. To all of you, what a, is this, Alicia, is this original music or is it licensed indie music? I'm guessing it's original. No worries, no worries, Hildred. Hope it's not us causing them, buddy. Don't need a PC. You missed the Poetry Jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. My backpack was stolen with a tablet. What if this is important? Poetry tryouts, laptop for 600. That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. Over the past decade, climate change has altered the... Oh, look at that, it's in Oregon! And I, I said it looks like Oregon. Damn, I'm good. Damn, I'm good. Including fish and fauna. Uh, this has helped decimate the state's fishing industry, especially in Arcadia Bay. Raise your voice against pollution and save our town. Good morning to you, Disaster Peace. How are you, buddy? Yeah, so Alicia, do you know or are you able to look up... Um, uh, yes, right, it is. Well, no, it's technically morning. It's 12.35 a.m. Um, Alicia says, I know that some YouTube videos were muted for copyright because of the music, so I'd say licensed. Yeah, definitely. It's good, though, isn't it? It's great. Thank you very much, Alicia. I wonder what actually happened to her. Oh, is that the same chick? It is. I wonder if this is set in 2013. Good thing I left my AK at home. Oh god, gun-free zone. Gee, that's a bit topical now, isn't it? They should just call it a sugar machine. 
walk. Yeah. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. <laughs> oh god, where are we going? Um, talking about her own place. Principal doesn't come out of his office much. It's really good. I love the style of it, Alicia, so far. We're only like you know, two sexes into the game. Oh no, it's another. Sorry. She's so pretty. Miss Grant? I hate these posters. So sad. Miss Grant is a great science teacher. How many students ever actually memorize all this shit? <laughs> I guess we all should these days. Yeah, for emergencies. There's the lighthouse again. The big Hello. Stop. I should develop some school spirit. Go Welcome team. back, Eldred. He's cute. I like skater boys. Too bad they don't like me. Said he was a skater boy. Thank you, Avril. God, Samuel is such a weirdo. But I kind of like that about him. <laughs> he looks like a creepy doctor. You can really learn a lot about a school by the weird shit posted on the boards. Best singer ever in Oregon, looking for the best guitarist to form a kick-ass band. Sad, lonely, depressed, Bible study, swim like an otter, and a new tablet. Contains five gigabytes of cat pics. (laughs) Yeah, the music is so relaxing, isn't it? It's awesome. This is great. Part of the world Look at these trophies. Gotta give it up for those big foots. They do stomp. I love the graphic style too. It's very well done. There's Juliet from my dorm. Yet another Vortex Club disciple. Figures Juliet would be dating Zachary. Jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. There's Hayden. Another Vortex Club bro. But he's actually not an ass. Oh, I can hardly wait to never be too cool like Nathan and Victoria. Lame. It's Bible study, quote unquote. Right? Toilet? Oh no, we're not a man. I'm so hardwired to go into the men's toilets. There we go. Missing person poster. What's this one? Nerd alert. This poster has Warren written all over it. Hey, we made it to the loo. Oh, we can relax Empty. now. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. That was cool how the music did that when she took her earbuds out. That was really freaking awesome. Gosh, the um the the lighting and the distortion filters on the game look amazing like if you look at those mirrors and stuff like they're kind of a bit blurry i can't remember what that's called now it's called ah a lot of games have it nowadays where it's kind of a little bit rainbow colored and blurry can't remember the name of it but that i mean you know it's clearly a um low polygon um painterly style yet it looks so good that's really awesome this one time at band camp like totally um right where do we go Oh, what's that? Graffiti. Now, who would bother to write that crap? Rachel Amber is a bitch. But it's true. It's so true. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Great camera Fuck angles. How would she throw that away for? What's that? When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Is that a butterfly? Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Um, but I want to look in the mirror. Can I look in the mirror? 
I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Hmm. What's the poster? The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Yeah, I don't do flu shots for that very reason. I don't, I mean, I don't want to get the flu. I'm good to flow. Thanks. Okay, too much information. For me. This poster must drive people to have sex. Abstinent makes the heart grow fonder. You can still love and learn without sex. Time is on your side, so is common sense. Use it. Kate twerks for God. Oh my lord. Huh? That's, I guess, what would be at a school, yeah? Why oh, what's this butterfly? Don't Whoa, where did that butterfly come from? Yeah, that's weird. It doesn't look like any kind I've ever seen before. The blue wings are practically glowing. I, I can almost feel the air moving around me. The butterfly feels almost like a spirit. Well, I just thought it was very bright blue. I wouldn't quite go to that extent. I, but anywho, um, excuse me one moment because I want to check uh, our stream health is all good, etc., etc. Yep. And while we're there, uh, just let me go to chat just so I can say hello to you guys. Hi. Thanks hello. for all the recent uh, joiners there. Um, uh, you guys, as you know, because you're the best, right? You guys are the best. So it follows, therefore, that you should get lots of internet points. She'd be tripping, dude. She'd totally be tricking. How are you to kill mine? Good to see you, buddy. Um, and have another couple of hundred points, you guys. Thank you so much for coming along tonight. I hope you're enjoying this so far. Gosh, I'm loving it. I'm totally loving it. It's really well done, isn't it? Well, I think so, anyway. All right, let's take a photo of this. Wee points. That's right, Alicia. Hope you guys are relaxing and just chilling, sitting back. Uh, nothing to do. Hopefully, it's your Saturday. Uh, and you can just uh, basically watch this interactive TV show, I guess. Hey, eh? why not? Alright, I, I totally want a Polaroid camera now. Hey, hey, it's a guy. What's the guy doing in the ladies' bathroom, you freak? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Looks that way, Uldred. Don't Brisk be scared. Game. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. And you're in the ladies. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my stepass would say. Now, let's talk business. I oh, got nothing for you. Is that Wrong. Ashley Birch? You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! <gasps> what? And yes, that's her. Thank you, Alicia. I love this game, so it's a great start to my morning. Holy shit! What just happened? Whoa, whoa! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Whoa! These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings. This is real. Now, Shit. Can you give no. me an example of a Damn, photographer? I cannot believe who this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Diane. Can I actually reverse time? Go, what? Why Arvis? Oh my god, I'm reversing time. And I guess that gauge up the top left is how much I can reverse it by. I did now, it. 
Can you give I actually me an did it. A photographer who perfectly I'm captured a human the human time machine. Black and white? Anybody? Max, Bueller? don't freak out. No. There you Wowzer, go. Wowzer, my old broken Why camera is new again. Keep it together, Max. Of of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad When I took my people. selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll notice this for real. Kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. She I know I'm not dreaming this. You all know it's real. Right to kill mine? I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. Oh yeah, can we save, can save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest in creating well done, conversation, Shadow. conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portrait? Well done, sound director number three. <laughs> Very weird. So this is interesting because I mean, yeah, we could see things and then. Yeah, help. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me you after class. A French and I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again Darian and give him the right answer? Fine detail in people's faces, this icon making means them extremely you popular fact from the 1800s you might be able to use if you rewind. The first American to Gary Okay. Hold shift to rewind faster. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest in this is interesting conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, that. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> oh, the Daguerrean yeah. process burn. made portraiture hugely Sick popular, burn. mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so what far is going on? ahead of that. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes Contest. To look I'll fly at all out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor! <laughs> Thank you, Alicia. Yes, Max. I see you pretending not to see Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. Holy shit, this is... Intense. Um, was I supposed to look at all the other stuff on my desk? Does it matter that I missed it? Do, do I have to look at all these things again? Surely not, right? Um, I mean, if we look at this, is it the same? Yeah, only look. What about Kate? Speak. Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Oh, it's different. Kate, um, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just tripping. Too much stress. I know the feeling. No matter who wins. This is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. I have my moment in the camera. I am. Everybody should have their chance. I only want to share whatever gifts I have. What are you waiting for? Go. Yeah, okay. I do want to see these though. Look, look, use. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Okay. Do we talk to Blackwell? I mean, uh... Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, Alicia says, it's okay you missed the desk, but in general, yeah, look at everything since it can change. Yeah, obviously, I mean, um, Kate's answer changed to us, right? Um, so I guess we could learn some important clues. I will I will try and remember to do that. Thank you for the advice, Alicia. Um, you knew it, right? You knew it to kill. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time, waiting for the 
elusive right moment? It's an, exactly. It's a good campaign. Max, through the door. Don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Press control to quickly undo your previous action using the rewind. Okay, I just tapped control then. What? I don't understand. Why did I want to do that? Is it so I can talk to him and say something different? Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photographers. Okay, and skip that. Um. Oh! Oh my god! Because John Lynn. Wow! Okay, god, this is getting deeper and deeper and my brain's hurting. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. Jeez, that's All awesome. the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. I would never have thought to do that, actually. I never would have thought of doing that. So, wow. Okay, so a control tap just sort of does an insta rewind, I guess. Um, whereas I, if I hold right mouse button, it, it manually rewinds. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Okay, let's just go straight there. Please, please. Hold shift. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. God, it's so different going through this time, isn't it? Like it just feels totally different. You know I don't tease. Oh my God, this is this is so cool. I'm loving this. Oh, different. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're what messing around do? with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Don't, Come on, put oh, that thing oh, down. Oh, oh, oh. Tell me what to do. Wow, sir, it's a, sick. I need a hammer to break it open. Shit! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would quick, quick, ever quick, even quick. miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Ah! Holy shit! I can't let this happen. No. If I can reverse time again, I can help You're her. not affected. I'm not affected by the rewind. I retain facts I have to and inventory. Now. Oh my god, so I get to keep the hammer. Even though I'm rewinding time, it doesn't affect me, right? Trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble uh, for uh, this uh, than uh. drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? No way! Don't ever touch me again, freak! <laughs> Another shitty day. That oh my did god. not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Okay, my brain is spinning. That was so cool. So I rewind time and I still get to keep the hammer, basically, is, is that is what I learned from that. Awesome camera angles. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. <laughs> excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Whew. I did, Alicia. I saved her. I feel good. Principal Wells always looks so distracted. I can never figure out what he's thinking. Does he hate me? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, 
Talk to me. Shit. Um. Um. Yeah, his face is super messed up, isn't it? It's a bit weird. They could have done better there. Um, thank God there's no timer here. Um, I don't know what to do. I mean, how do I report? If I report, I, oh! Talk about throwing me in the deep end straight away. Um, okay, let me think this through. If I hide the truth, it means that jerk could get away with it again. But if I report him, it could lead to questions that I can't possibly explain. But I need, I feel morally obliged. Sorry if this is the wrong thing, but I feel obliged to report. Oh, you guys, you guys, thank you. Thank you. By the way, feel free to say what you would do. Like, basically, um, the way I see this playthrough, I'm a grown-up. I can make up my own decisions. Um, and I can choose whether or not to be influenced by your answers. So I would prefer that you type. So play along at home. Um, whether you've played the game before or it's brand new for you as well, please type in chat for things like this because I want that. Because I can look at this and I still might choose, even though you've all said report, I might choose hide the truth because that's what I think. But um, I'm glad that you guys said the same. Report this punk ass says disaster piece because he brought a freaking gun to school hello he had a gun at school report easy as that right thanks guys and please play along please play along i'm not going to get uh, upset if you um say what you think i just saw nathan prescott waving a gun around in the girls room nathan prescott you sure yes he was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girl's room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girl's bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. Oh God. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. He's protecting him. He's of course totally... this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Um. Um. Principal Wells always looks so distracted. I can never figure out what he's thinking. He's... Does he hate me? He's protecting that dude, isn't he? Wait, what if I speak? Don't wander around here. Get on outside. So I could rewind and change it to the other one, right? I mean, the thing is, if he's in league with the prestigious family, then they're going to mark me as a troublemaker. Whereas if I just say, nah, nothing was wrong. You know what I mean? No! What do you guys think? Like, can I rewind again? Like, can I go back now and rewind and do the other choice? And then if I don't like it, rewind again and redo my original choice? Do you know what I mean? So, can I, is there any limit to how many times I can rewind? Let's try it. Why not? He might be the guy's dad. Yeah, you don't know, right? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, I'm just a little worried about Hello, my Steph. future. Hello, Steph. You're sweating pinball. Okay. Oh, that's great how you can skip forward to bits. Okay, let's try this this time. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Please. Shit. 
No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. I'm boned either way. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Now I'm thinking, Vinnie Barbarino! I'm so confused! Good old John Travolta, eh? I liked him back in those days. Um, okay, so... I mean, I was going to say, with that second answer we gave, there might be another better time in the future to confront the principal about the, uh, the guy with the gun. Maybe this isn't the time. But now I've just got myself in trouble with my parents, so I'm going to do the right thing again, I think. If this guy's crooked, then karma will catch up with him. I, I want to have a squeaky clean. You look a little stressed out. Let's report him. I just saw Nick. All right. Man. Uh, by the way, there's no map, is there? Where's outside? Is it? Is that outside? Wow, that looks great. Gosh, these developers... Would Nathan Prescott, please come to the front <gasps> office. Thank you. Oh, God. Oh, at least... Oh, see, if they're in league with each other, they're going to be talking about me right now. Um, whoever the devs are for this game, um, can't remember now, I saw it before. One of them must work in TV, I reckon. A missing person poster. Hello, Ms. Grant. Hi, Ms. Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Ms. Grant a favor and hear me out? Um, Steph says every action completely changes the outcome, really. So I could do multiple playthroughs of this as well. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Could have helped Rachel, that's for sure. Um. David Madsen doesn't need another excuse to harass students here. Max, this isn't about personalities. This is about protecting civil rights and our school's legacy of freedom. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. What? The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first, who welcomed the settlers. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? God. I didn't know I'd have to think so much. <laughs> Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not your surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. This action will have... Oh god, they're ramming it down my throat. Everything I do is gonna like have major consequences later on. Ah! I would so be there if a Sasquatch actually did battle a Razorback. She's got a cool outfit on. Hey Hayden! There's Hayden in his Vortex Club harem. He sure is living the dream. Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. <laughs> um, Disaster Piece says she apparently doesn't know much about history if she thinks native and settlers lived in peace. Yeah, exactly, right? Exactly. Uh, and your cat is watching me again. Really? Really? Uh, 
Hello, Pussycat. I wonder if it's Gizmo. Is it Gizmo? Uh, he must like Sambo's voice. Maybe. Maybe. Or maybe it's just the pretty moving picture color things. I've just got to alt over to here for a second. And oh, Steph. What are you doing, Steph? You know you're going to get another telling Thank off. Thank you. Another telling off with the 50 bits there. Thank you so much, Steph. That's so kind of you. Does that mean uh, if I total up your bits today, does that mean I can use your donation, Steph, to go and buy myself a Starbucks again in the morning? Can I do that? Because I would love to do that. And thank you so much. You're so kind. Bless you. Thank you. Um, Talon says, yes, yeah, Sambo, the world will explode because of your choices. Yeah, I'm the, I mean, these are pressured choices here. These things have weight and meaning. Uh, and they're kind of morally black and white. You know what I mean? There's no... Like most bioware games you just like just just hit number one 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 if you want to play paragon two 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 if you want to be neutral three 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 if you you know what i mean like who cares just dribble um but with this it's like so do you want uh, that person to die or that person to die like, ah! good lord all right got permission thank you steph uh let's talk about oh yeah we'll talk about that what the hell is the vortex club anyway it seems so elitist only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night, then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. Yeah, that's a fair point. You know what, if you don't check something out, um, you have no right to comment about it, really. You mean hang with a Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. <laughs> Chillax, paranoia girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. <laughs> so you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh yeah, and she was hot. Uh, what do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. <laughs> yeah, I, I want to know about Nathan. He's the guy with the gun, right? Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. Uh... He seems genuinely unstable to me. Nate has his extreme moments, but don't we all? I don't know yet, Hayden. Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Hmm. I mean, he had some fair points there. We're, we're kind of being a little bit prejudiced, to be honest. Uh, Brooke, you look cool. Brook actually has a drone. Oh wait, is that what that thing was buzzing around before? I saw it, there was something flying around my head. I thought I was going crazy actually. Wait, where is it? There's a guy skateboarding over there. I swear there was a drone flying I'm around. I'm gonna read here. Warren's text before he blows my phone up. Hello? Sorry, running late, insane day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Wait, where's the drone? I want to see the drone. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Yeah, shit, yeah. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? 
Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Well, didn't expect that. Hmm. I'm almost sure Warren has the same bag. It looks a bit nerd. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Hmm. I... Wait, why do we want to rewind? What did I do wrong? Sorry, Max. I have to focus on making sure this drone doesn't crash. What? What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Yeah, harsh, right? I was shut down. That was weird. But I don't know why... Why did it give me a rewind opportunity then? I didn't really do anything bad. Um, and I don't think the game's on a timer, right? Like, I'm... I'm I know I have to go meet What's-His-Face. But where's the... Dr the drone... Where's it gone? I saw it flying around before. Uh, so you can talk again without looking stupid. Oh, really? Okay. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Ah, oh, right. Thank you. Thank you, Shokashuk. Who's that? Shokashuko, hello to you. Um, thank you for the advice, by the way. I keep forgetting that I can do that. Um, you may get an opportunity to rewind when you make a choice. Yeah, yeah. So I'm... God, of course. And I, look, the game taught me that in the opening sequence, and it's still I'm so stupid that I didn't learn. I've talked. I learned something. I looked in the backpack. I should automatically think, hang on, I've got new information so I can rewind. What a dick. Thank you for your advice. And please give me that advice. I'm absolutely not going to get upset if you say, Samba, 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 stop, stop. You need to rewind there. No, please do. <laughs> Thank you. That looks like a high fly drone. Model B400 EVO. Now that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that. Especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. Here, give the drone a whirl around campus. Yeah, boy. Whee! Ha <laughs> ha Jeez. Oh yeah, making our own music video with the glow stick. <laughs> Good timing. Now where is it though? I want to see it. Because I saw it before, it was right in front of my face. It's like bright colours. Fountain? This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow, I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Oh, you're right, Talon. Is, that's the picture of the bust that's in my journal, right? So. For example, here, that, there. Is that what we're talking about? Yeah, I don't think I can... I don't think I could take photos. There wasn't any button opportunities. But, I mean, that's definitely a photo of that 
um, bust. So I will go try again, for sure. Um, now we've got some more people here. Dollar, dollar bill. Boom, dramatic, yeah. Should I go straight to the police? What do I say about my rewind? Yeah, it's tough for me to go to the police when I say, oh yeah, I can rewind time. Oh dear. Okay, that says a lot about this guy. Bro dude, swag is everywhere with that badge and gun like he's looking to tase somebody. Yeah, that's the type I pick him as as well. Um, seems a bit stressed out. I reckon he's in on it. I reckon he's protecting the rich kid. Um, I could be wrong. So yeah, how else do we get a photo of that statue? And I'm guessing that kid on the skateboard's going to break it. Um, oh, we got more pages in our diary. Wait, what was that? I need to go to my room to get Warren's flash drive. Oh, okay, so we can see what the objective is on a yellow poster note. It's really cool. Uh, you can do it afterwards in chapter mode if taking photo is too hard. Thanks, Shokashuk. I mean, I'll try. I, 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 I didn't think there were any controls on it, though. This does not exist. This is where it gets strange. When Nathan fired the gun, came around the corner, reached out for some dumb reason, as if I could stop the bullet. I literally thought I'd been um, dosed with some drug until I calmed myself down. Major Groundhog Deja Vu. That's very funny. Until I got grilled by the security chief who, chief who thinks he's Chuck Norris. Yeah, Nathan Prescott almost kills a girl in the bathroom, but no, I'm the problem. He didn't believe me when I told him about Nathan, made me feel like shit. Yeah, that's a hell of a day she's had. Um, generally you need to get the right timing or situation for the photos. Ah, you have a camera you carry with you. Sometimes you need to find the right angle to get the photo option. Ah, thanks guys. Okay, so... If, is it a little pussycat? No, oh, it's a little squirrel. Um, so the photo... I bet the Black Wolf founders would shit cats if they saw today's student body walking around like zombies on their phones. Oh, these coins. This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody got their wish. So if it's a good image, can I take a photo? No. Photo, photo, photo. I see what you mean. Thank you, guys. Thank you. I keep forgetting that I have to... Oh, I've got an achievement. Wide angles. A steam achievement. Go away achievement. Oh, I missed what it said on the screen. Um, but I'm guessing that now... Yep, there we go. Okay. Oh, wait. The squirrel. is a squirrel and a skateboard. So, squirrel is over here. But there's no coke can. Hmm. Stella always looks so serious and dedicated. Good for her. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? Um... She did say that drones are great for taking photos. Yeah, I yeah, I made that connection as well. Uh, says Ildred. Um, wait, I can't read that. I'm so sorry. Who are you? You're Hostriloki. Hello, Hostriloki. How are you? Uh, I just beat this game yesterday, and now I wish I could forget it and play it all over. Ah, oh, that's a that's a really big compliment, actually, for a game, isn't it? It's neat. Hello to you, by the way. Thanks for joining us. Lord of the reference, Lord of the Rings reference in the journal. Really? Oh, we'll just have a look. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher, and I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. 
Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. <laughs> if Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. And <laughs> now that you mention it. Victoria is pretty obvious. I don't think Jefferson is into her. I don't think she's closed the deal, but she's not the only player. Now, Jeez. how do you know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. What? Well, I heard that from a good source. Well, that escalated quickly. They're talking about their teacher, for God's sake. Um, I forgot to finish this, says Shokushuku. Shokushuko. Uh, I think that I had a chapter or two left. What? How could you forget to finish this? Bulgara says, uh, why is everyone touching their head or fixing their hair every 10 seconds? Yeah. <laughs> well, they are like totally rad at school. You know what I'm saying, Bulgara. You know, like totally. Um, Host says, yeah, I've been playing games since the 90s and really say anything like that about games. Yeah, I'm a bit, bit cynical as well. Um, so wait, this is the Rachel that's missing. So... You knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Um, do I need to speak with her again and rewind? I don't think I learned anything that I need to worry about, do I? That's so cool that Blackwell is doing a show of Mr. Jefferson's work. <laughs> There's Justin and his skater posse. They're so cute doing their tricks. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? <laughs> thrash, yeah. I know what that means. Oh, totally. yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh, jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Okay, we're rewinding that shit. Yep. Got the hang of this now. Yo, Justin. Check out the max. Come. I came to no slide, baby. I came to no slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah. I just can't skate worth shit. Aw, oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Uh, we'll see a no slide, thanks. I'd love to see a nose slide. Let's get Trevor all over that action. Ha, <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. Hello, Trevor. Can we speak with you? No. Man, the music's awesome. Daniel is always drawing something. He makes me look like an extrovert. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. Um... Uh... I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Um. You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. So what happened to her? There's got to be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Ah, she had a good heart. Okay, why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. Oh! No way! You're a good substitute, Muse. Yeah, right, Ildred. Not creepy at all. Creep, oh, creep. That's a good posture. <laughs> right, Hello. right to kill. I want you to uh, draw me like one of your French girls. Good, good. Hey, Seek, how are you? Hello. He is 
is a bit creepy, but oh, that's cool. Ever. That's cool. Hmm. Um. Okay, I'll try. I, I don't know what we can change there, but I'll try. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. I'd rather not, Daniel. Not that I don't want you to. Never mind. I guess you would be too ashamed. Now, I have to get oh, back to no. my Oh, no! You're eating a meat pie. Yum. Uh, let's try the other one again. What's up, Daniel? Oh. I'd be honored. Funny you should say that. Um... Okay, why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down. No way, you're a good... Hmm, that was a tough one. I don't, yeah, I'm a bit confused about that one. I don't know why... Like, there seemed only one option, really. Because if I said no, I was going to offend him. I didn't want to offend him, really. Did someone spy on her? Oh, what do you mean, Victoria? Clever. Hello, by the way. What is it? Vortex? What, what, what? Clever. Vortex Club sucks. Oh, aha. We need a rim shot for that one, I reckon. That's Luke Parker. Zachary pushed him into a locker last week. Go oh, boys. Oh, him. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. Uh, we, you know what, if we fuck it up, we can rewind, so let's, let's be nosy. Oh, there's the, there's the, can you hear it? There's the drone. What's wrong? There it is. Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. You, you know him. Um, should we tell someone about, oh God, this could be bad. If I say I busted him, he's going to say what for, and I'm going to say a gun. Oh, we can rewind, so hell, why not? I busted him today with a gun. What? Seriously? I saw him wave a gun around today, and I went to the principal. We'll see what happens next. You are my new hero. Finally, karma comes to Blackwell. Um, looked like somebody watched it from above a window or something. Maybe, Victoria, maybe, maybe indeed. Uh, all right, I'm happy with the consequences there. Um, who else can we talk to? Who's this dude? Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. I think his name is Evan. He always looks so intense. Yeah, the butterfly effect, right, Shares? That's what I was thinking too. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. Ah. No portfolio peak for you. That's okay. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're... Uh, Steve McCurry? Unless he could travel back in time. McCurry was born five years after the Falling Soldier picture. McCurry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. No problem. <laughs> right? Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your... Let's see if you're... Thank you. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. Sweet. 
Music's awesome. These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is Rachel. mesmerizing. She's the one that's missing. 2011, 2012. Thanks, Evan. I'm just going to look what's down this end of school. Who's he? She? Hello? No? Nobody? I want to know where the drone is. You saw it like the shadow of it fly across my face before, right? Oh. There it is! There it is! There it is! There it is! Straight ahead. See it? Here we go. Yeah, I knew it. I thought... I thought I wasn't going crazy. God, that's just what they sound like too, isn't it? How funny. Ah, I feel better now. Seems like she was a popular girl at school. Sure does, eh, Starhawk Ranger? Oh, that's not nice. Poor little otter. Ooh, gross. At least switch to E6. Fape. Hello, squirrel. Um, we need a Coke can with you, so I guess we're not at the right time or place. They sure get a lot of mileage out of otter power. Swim team. Otter power? I'm so not there. And this is where the otters perform their aquatic magic. But we can't go in there, that's okay. Missing person, look, what's that? I'm sure this poster has stopped millions of bullies. Too much information, bully march, Bible study. Um, now the thing is, I don't know where we meant to go. Now I have to go back to the dorm. This day never ends. So, yeah, I need to go to my room to get Warren's flash drive. But where's my room? There's no, is there a map here? There's no map, right? So where's... Signpost parking. Oh no, is it down here? Warren's waiting for me and his flash drive in the parking lot, so I better get back to my dorm. Right, but I don't know where my dorm is. I mean, that's the school. Is it, uh. Nope, I don't want to go there. Am I being a dumbass? Is the dorm back inside the school? Hang on, wait, is there a sign? Yeah, sign. Swimming pool, parking. Um. Ah, dormitories, right. Duh. Mr. Jefferson has such a gift for different styles. Dormitories, right. Look at the sign, Sambo. Duh. Aha. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. I knew that, right? I totally knew that. <clears throat> Come on, Logan, bring it, bro. Yeah. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. The Prescott Dormitory? Good lord, Nathan's family oh owns my dorm? God. Yeah. Don't like this guy. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. I can fix that. Oh. Hi, Max. How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. I think you're better off reading Just Chicklet. Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Sorry. 
I really have to find out what happens. Did meme. The signs no the way. <laughs> Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. You. Uh, it's not dead for long though. It's only five minutes old. Does that make it super? Oh God! It's Victoria. Oh shit. There's Victoria and her Mean Girls. Mean Girls. Hello there, Swanovan. How are you, buddy? Good to see you. Um, let's speak with you. Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Oh, what a bitch. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, Mark? falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. No. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Where's that gun? Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh wait, hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. I'm doing okay, thanks yourself. Good. I'm Do you understand English? Get lost. Okay, we so have to get this bitch. Oh, it's a butterfly. Hello, butterfly. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Nice. There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Oh, could I? Oh, oh, wait. Wait, I'm seeing an opportunity here. There's paint going up the ladder. It's going to go up there, and I reckon I can drop paint on her. I'm just... I don't know. That's what I reckon. I know we can probably go down there. Nice, bro. You don't want to talk to me today? Aha! Aha! Make art, not war. Guess what? Guess what? That's a photo. How do I get it? You know, look, look, look. It's that photo there. How do we do it? Come on, what? Uh, am I doing something wrong here? There's only one way around this. It's not upright. Oh, really? Was it upright in here? Oh, okay. Alright, maybe that's not the one. That's a bit annoying, though. Why, why did sh Okay, maybe... Oh, do I rewind more? Right. Right, gotcha, gotcha. Hmm. A paint bucket next to Victoria. I see a plan. Ah, oh, okay. Thanks, Alicia. Alicia says I might have missed the chance to get that by triggering okay, the event with Victoria. Okay, let's see if this Victoria. works. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. I see nothing. Maybe I can go there in a minute. Come on, Samuel. Sweet. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. What the hell? Okay. I'm gonna, uh, that's me rewinding. Uh, wait, I want to see what's in here. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. Chill, Victoria. It's just oh, water. Dude. Yeah, 
water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. All right, that's good. I've done that. And by the way, thank you so much for the follow. Who was that? Let me just alt tap out of here and have a quick look see. Uh, that is Laney, Laney Uncaney. Thank you so much, my Portal One thank you. turret says thank you, uh, and thank you so much for the support. You guys are the best. Here's your rewards. Maybe the guys threw their football at the squirrel by mistake. Maybe tell him. Maybe. God, there's so many options, aren't there? Good lord. Okay, well, I've done my work in here. So now we can go get that bucket, hopefully. Let's do that again. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Uh, wait, what? No, rewind more. Okay, quick, 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 quick. So do the sprinkler now. Quick. Tamper with the bucket. Okay, let's see if this works. Whoa, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yes! Oh, Samuel, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Bitches. Oh, yeah. Can we please get a heck yeah? Can we get a heck yeah? Come on. Well, I would be a hypocrite if I wasn't grateful for Blackwell's sprinkler system today. Um, now let's quickly see if we can, per your advice, let's see if we can talk to these dudes. Hey, Logan Robertson. All-American asshole. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. I think it's, um, Y-E-H, Ildred. Sorry. Where's the totem there? Zachary always looks like he'd rather be throwing back a beer than a football. Football, Max. Big football. Step away. Hmm. Nice, bro. Totem. Look. Warren told me that totem is named Tabanga for a reason nobody knows. Thank you. Glad to see our campus is eco friendly. There's Kate, looking sadder than usual. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. Yeah, we can, Alicia. How did you like class today? I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Let's try that again. Awesome. Hi, Kate. <laughs> You look down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. Is there anything... Max, nice. I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Uh, well, there were only two options. That's all I could do. Aha! Thanks, you were right, Alicia. This is going to be too damn cute. At least it's not a cat picture. Okay. Done. All right, we need a broken skateboard, and I'm guessing this is in the dorm because it's a bunk, right? Um, do we have any more? Oh, we've got some new pages. Everything feels so surreal. Can't talk to anybody about it. Till I can figure this out, I better stay on the down low. Watched a few episodes of Doctor Who and the X-Files, binged on Full Metal Alchemist, oh my god. I just started watching that on Netflix, um, the new one, the uh, real live version of it. Uh, then Faster Pussycat, Kill Kill, all kinds of Amazon woman, black and white, ba wow, Tetsuo, <gasps> and Scott Pilgrim. This chick rocks, right? She totally rocks. That is amazeballs. 
On a side note, I saw a missing poster on uh, missing persons poster on campus for Rachel Amber and a pretty Blackwell student who vanished. Had to go back to the dorm to get Warren's flash drive, and yes, Victoria and her vixens blocked me. Uh, and I even took my picture. It was so high school movie. I can't believe she did it. She told me to go fuck your selfie, though. It's kind of funny. Wow. Uh, this is great. Right, I wonder what happens now when we go talk to Miss Bitchface. Oh man, she looks so sad and lonely sitting there alone. Uh... Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Oh, can I? Please, can I? Can we please make fun of her while we decide that? What do you guys want me to say? What do you reckon? Um, I need to go get a drink. So I will uh, just pause for a second and put myself on mute. I will be. I won't go to the be right back screen because you guys have to help me here. Which do we do? Can we just please indulge ourselves and make fun of her? Come on, she's such a bitch. Uh, I'll be back in a minute. Oh yeah, sick burn, right? Uh, I'll be back in just a minute, guys. I'm dying for a drink. See you in a moment. And welcome back. Sorry about that. God, it's so hot here. Dying of thirst. Oh, uh, by the way, how's the volumes with everything? Game's okay. Everything's cool. Stream quality should be fine. Um, all right. So, Dekil says make fun of her. I, wa I really want to do that. <laughs> Steph says, I just created my alt character for the Horde Guild. A to troll druid. Congratulations. You've seen the light, Steph. Well done. I knew you'd come around. Uh, Talon says, was that a Tauren Druid? No. Alicia says, well, comfort is being the better person, but you can make fun uh, of her if you want. Yeah, I mean, I'm up for being the better person, but we can rewind, right? Um, Sele, Selen, Selenia. Selenia. Excuse me, is her real name? Oh, is her name, sorry. Uh, Steph, you make a troll, yeah, Alicia. See, Steph has seen the way. Uh, Bagara says, after she told you to um, F your selfie, you want to comfort her. Yeah, I know. Like, I've got a streak in me that just wants to really get her back. You did nothing to provoke her either. That's right, Bulgaris. Uh, but now you are so well that help. Hmm. Um... I would comfort her too, says Shaz. Ashley says, make fun of her. Hello, Ashley. How are you, buddy? Good to see you, man. Um, the boss says, make fun of. And Talon says, rise above. Oh, you guys aren't making this any easier, you know. Um, oh, God. So you guys actually made it worse. <laughs> because half of you said, make fun of her. Half have said, comfort. Well, here's my justification. I reckon we make fun of her. Then rewind and comfort. How's that? So her lasting memory will be of us comforting her, but I'll get the innate satisfaction of getting her back. Let's try see what happens. <sighs> Consequences, folks. Consequences. You can just rewind, right? I better be able to rewind. I know, I'm so confused as well. Don't tell... What, what if we can't rewind? Wait a minute. 
We can rewind any time, right? A kid would make fun and adult would come. It's true. No, that's a good plan. Ah! I want... Okay. I think the good in me wants to leave this with comforting her, but I want to see what happens and get it out of my system. I feel I've made a grave mistake. Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. <gasps> oh, Ben! Ben! And no filter needed before I post this. Oh, can we have a burn? Woo! Now please move. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Oh, yeah, baby. Now I have to get to my room. Then see more. Burn! But no, I can't do that. That felt far out. That felt good. It felt so good, though. What a sick burn. No. But... Like everyone said, we can rise above it. We can rise above it. We don't want to become what she is. Uh, hey, Victor. Felt good though, didn't it, guys? Woo! I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Nice. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and, and the go fuck yourselfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Wow. Au Whoo! Okay. Jeez. That's amazing. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Nuts. Better get to my room before I find Warren. She was being genuine. That was good. That's the way I want to leave it. Batman. Batman Sambo. Burn it down. Uh, how are you, by the way? Ashley, do you... I don't know about you, but here in Australia... Yeah, baby. <laughs> um, what's the weather like for you, Ash, in Singapore? Here in Melbourne, it's ridiculous. It's a really strong, hot, hot wind, and it's really uncomfortable, and everyone's sneezing and melting, and I'm so hot. It's just stupidly hot. We hate it. And it's blimmin', it's already fall or autumn. It's crazy. What's it like there? I love these bits. Map. Welcome to Black Hill. So I'm 219. Alright. I get really humid and hot, then... Uh, come a five minute downpour and then back to humid hot. Yeah, right. Yep, I know exactly what you mean. Pikaki, hello buddy. How are you, man? Uh, same as every day, 30 plus occasional rain, 100% humidity. Of course, you're both in uh, Singapore, so yeah. Uh, I'll take some of that warmth. No, Doc, you don't want it. You know, you can always warm up, but it's hard to cool down, and especially when you don't have aircon like me. Uh, it's minus 15 degrees. Oh, I'd love that right about now. Oh, Room 217. No way in hell am I ever going in here. Oh, look, that's them. Taking the cashmere back. That's really funny. Gosh, it's a well-produced game, this, isn't it? Uh, why'd the music stop? I hope that wasn't my fault. I thought it would go the whole way along the hall. Um, anyway, HIV and AIDS. Reward for the backpack. And to the bitch that stole my Franju New Face Cream. That was some expensive shit. I need it for my acne. I know exactly how it exfoliates, and I'll be watching your skin the second it clears up. <laughs> yeah, it's kind Go of funny. Go, Miss Grant. Not sure if I will, though. I'm a loser. Don't let Big Brother watch you. Uh, intrusive surveillance system. Hold a public forum. Please come speak out against this invasion of privacy. Yep, for sure. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. It was snowing here again earlier. Talon, really? Oh, can you bundle some up and uh, mail it to Melbourne for me, please? Thank you. 
I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. What is it? Learn how to operate firearms. Ugh. Man, people here are merciless. What? Oh, this is the abstinence thing. See Kate's what? Video for proof. Oh dear. Man, I wonder Kate... If I was Kate, I would have run away as well, I reckon. Juliet, extreme reporter. Be alert on campus. Wait, let's read. Report any incident. You know, we did that. Didn't get Could us anywhere. Fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. No boy wizards or vampire fiction allowed. No boys, period. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoops, there's another one. Wait. One. Could two. be. Thanks for the warning. Vortex Club coming soon. Mm, okay, that's closed. Uh, I don't think we want to do the fire alarm again somehow. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. The toilet paper war. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, don't be a zombie. What's this one? They live. Social media has a time and place. Don't let life flash you by. Yeah, true, right? Too true these days. I was on the tram yesterday and oh my god just every single person like 100 percent hello hello 100 percent of them were just head buried in their screen it's just crazy when i think about what it used to be like only 10 years ago you know um we're supposed to have another storm uh this coming week really doc what part of um america do you live in and you can be as unspecific as you like but are you like central or uh, i can't remember uh to kill mine Recruit Jackal, do you know where Ella went? Jackal, I know I know the way. Is that meme again? Uh, Scarlet Karma, good morning from Texas. Good morning to you, Scarlet Karma. How are you, buddy? Thanks for coming along. Uh, you're Central... Yeah, uh, right, Central... Yeah, yeah, of course. So it's going to be a bit cool over there, right? Okay, this is just mean and stupid. We'll bang for Jesus. Uh, yeah, we'll get rid of that. That's better. Peace sign. The universal symbol for please leave me alone, asshole. Yep. Yep, I'm glad I did that. This is like the public DNA of our dorm. Don't let depression get you down. Lost phone and statistics tutor wanted. Meat is still murder. Join the Blackwell Vegan Club. Girls night out Halloweeny. Stream along. Nightmare Before Christmas. Buy monthly and buy friendly. Alright, uh, that's our room. Who's this? Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. Oh my god, be the change you wish to see in the world. Yeah, wish we could rub that one out. I don't think she really believes in that. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? This is your planet, and when it comes to protecting the environment, you're the boss. Up to us to make a choice, so come raise your voice, save the earth. I don't get why she said that. There's nothing weird about that. Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. They are. And by the way, happy pie day for a couple of days ago. You know that there's still some pineapple pizza pie emotes down there in the chat, right? You know it. Gee, the graphics are cool in this game, aren't they? Uh, Jaffa is back. Hello, Jaffa Cakes. Shut up. Shut up. Now I feel like eating some Jaffa Cakes. <laughs> like I did last time you were here, right? Funny. Nice to How see you, sad. buddy. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Yes, we do. Obviously, Bulgaris. That's what I was thinking, too. Uni unisex door. Oh. <laughs> Is that all we can muster, really? Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Ooh, we have good taste, don't we? Hey, hey, there's the wall. We need that for our journal, right? Um, um, that one there, I think. 
maybe not but definitely that one because look there's the photos in the background so maybe there's a room with our dorm in it i've got a funny feeling i missed the skateboard one oh wait wait my brain is flipping over do we did we have to try the skateboard and fail to get a photo and snap snap his skateboard or get him to try a different trick maybe Shit, I wonder if we can go back there at some point and get that. I probably didn't explore enough options. Um, that's what I'm thinking anyway. Why is there a new... Why was there a new... Why is there a star? You can see that, right? Look, there's a star there. Oh, is it this? Wait, sorry, it's this. Right, okay. Meanwhile, felt like shit seeing Victoria sitting there by herself on the steps covered in paint. She didn't look like the Queen Biarch of Blackwell, just a lonely girl as confused as me. I knew I had to find out if she was okay. She was actually nice and apologised. She even deleted the picture she took uh, of me off my phone, off her phone. So maybe there's hope for the future. I hope so too. I think that was the flip. Yeah, maybe. Because I, I said a, um, I asked him to do a, a no slide. Alright, that's done. That's definitely, yeah. Wait, oh, what? Max, your principal sent me an email saying that you told some tall tales about a black wall on, oh God. Honor student, is this true? Principal said this was a serious false charge. He's worried you're telling stories. Call me ACP so we can talk about it as much. Right, the principal is dirty, I reckon. I reckon the principal's in on it, the jerk face. I reckon totally in on it. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. Yeah, but let me take a photo of them. Let me. T I need to take a photo of them. Oh, right. Turn off. Why would I want to? Oh, we'll try it. See, it's an option. Now, can I take a photo? The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial no. Wall. No. Teddy bear. That's right. Half watching Sambo Hapakaki while playing Yakuza Zero. Nice choice, buddy. I can't wait to get into that myself. Seriously. Uh, and we're more than happy to be your background while you play that game. Enjoy, man. It is just brilliant. Uh, what I love is going through the Tokyo arcades. It's like being back in when I was like in growing up. Amazing. It's the, They've nailed the feel of all of those arcades. It's amazing. And walking down the streets there like you know near Shibuya and um, Akihabara and stuff it's very really cool very cool enjoy man hard to believe I'm 18 do I look any older just more stressed uh, I wonder if that oh achievement unlocked red eye Ah, oh, so that's that photo there. Okay. I'm happy about that. Um, hmm. It's a skateboard. But how do I get the wall photo? And there's the football with broken stuff. Oh, gosh, there's lots of things, huh? Anywho, let's have a look at this. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER... I knew we were bonded forever. <laughs> so cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. Sure. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. What do you mean? I don't know what she meant by that. I know she left her behind in Seattle. Um, look. I should hit the thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? Yes. I don't care. Music inspires me in my photography. Cartier-Bresson, Toyno, Hamilton, the greatest. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. <laughs> Listen to the music. Uh, yes, the Tokyo atmosphere is brilliant up for the uh, Yakuza series. Yeah, it's awesome, isn't it? Blackwell. There's a town in Oklahoma called Blackwell. Really? 
Uh, this is set in Oregon in Acacia Bay. I think it's what it's called. But it's definitely in Oregon. I can't believe I cho- uh, picked that. Childhood friend she hasn't talked to again yet. Yeah, that's right, Shokushuku. Shoku. I read the um, journal about how she left Seattle and left her behind. That was a good hockey game and uh, a great fight. Went to Seattle and left her behind, yeah. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Here's my go-to source for instant photo inspiration. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. I like this chick. I like her. I like being Max. She's awesome. There's my poor laptop begging me to check in. Daniel has so much talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. Oh, that's the sketch we had made. Yeah, that's cool. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Camera porn. <laughs> One-stop web resource for every camera ever produced. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Uh, Max, thanks for your email and copy of Jefferson's class notes. Now I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I also have a rather eclectic collection of TV, cult, classic, and fucked up films on a fat flash drive if you ever want to check them out. Thanks again for the help. I'm a scientist more than an artist. Now, can you quickly explain to me how a camera works? See ya. Warren G. <laughs> that's cool. Well, wow, porn is better, that's right. Especially when we're playing it, dude. Right? My porn add-on. You guys know it. Yeah, exactly. Thank you, Bogars. P-A-W-N. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HDTV. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. I haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. Yet. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. The action will have consequences? Watering a plant? Are you kidding me? If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. Wait. Window... Ball. I'm thinking that somehow. Hmm. Did you say owl? You can't throw it up here. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbirds. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Hell yeah. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? <gasps> it, <coughs> excuse me, folks. Oh, sorry. Sneezy wheezy. Ooh. It's such a pretty guitar. I need to play it more. Well, let's fix that. Thank you, Scarlet Karma. Thank you, Lake. Thank you, Eldred. Hey, Alatar, how are you, buddy? It's quite a collection of unrelated random brain static from her. It is, isn't it? Thank you, Doc. Ah, uh, to kill, sorry. <laughs> right, priorities. Warren can wait. I obviously need some jam time. Damn straight. Just get me in the mood, you know. Uh, now. 
Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. To Max, or whom it may concern, the cinematic contents of this flash drive are of a graphic, life-altering, controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care and for the most discriminating viewer. I congratulate you on your taste and eagerly await your in-depth reviews of Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Vixens. Peace. Okay, I like this guy. I like this guy a lot. He's freaking awesome. Uh, why can I not take a photo? I clearly need to take a photo of that, right? Like, I mean, it's like totally there. Right there. Cookies! Yum! Don't say cookies, I'm already hungry. <sighs> it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Uh, Alicia says, I tried to get a photo of that wall forever too, Sambo. Turns out, it's not that wall. <laughs> Thank you so much, Alicia. I do appreciate that. Uh, now, after all that, where the hell is the flash drive? Sticky note. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Oh, no! Hey girl, I borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. Well, there we go. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. Feeling... But I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. I opened the drawer, didn't I? Did I? Oh, yep. Max and Chloe, best friends. All right. Let's do it. She did. She sure you did. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Whoa. Wait. No, I, no. Don't lock her Welcome in. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. So stupid. Juliet looks like she's yeah, ready to throw what? down. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked girl. Dana in the room because we're cool. Uh, yeah, there are lights in the way of your photos. Yeah, good point, Kellen. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. What? Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Oh God! Go get that drive. Uh, Ildred has used the one hundred biddies. What are you doing, fine sir? Thank you. And he says, "Go get that drive." Yeah, that's true. That's true. I'll do that for a hundred bits. No problem. Thank you, buddy. It's very kind of you. Thank you so much. Uh, and if you weren't here earlier, uh, I've had permission to use the bits from tonight's stream tomorrow to have a nice Starbucks, nice tall, long uh, latte, and I can't wait. So uh, you guys have enabled that, and thank you so much. So kind of you. All right, um, I'm going to say she's an Olsen. Juliet, Ju Juliet Olsen. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. No worries. <laughs> we got this. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. If you don't let me out, I will scream. Yeah, that's, uh, hmm. How do you know? Victoria Chase. You know her. You could say that. But why would Dana go after your boyfriend? 
According to Victoria, Dana would do anything Here's to date a quarterback. Here's for a better lot to you later. According to Victoria... Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear um, okay, so who's this naughty person? Alicia, what have you done, Alicia? We have to have words about this, you realise. Thank, Thank you so much for the 100 bits there. 100 of them. What are you doing? Here's for a better latte later. You know what? With those extra 100 bits now, thank you, I can ab absolutely upgrade. Are you ready for this, Alicia? I can go for a venti. And that's going to keep me going all morning. That's awesome. Uh, so thank you so Dana much. I can help and check out Victoria's room to find out if she is the kind of person I hope she's not. Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. Hang on, do I have to rewind this? I've lost the plot here. Yeah, exactly right, Ildred. I'm absolutely going to do that. Absolutely. Thank you guys so much. Going to get a massive one as well. Uh, and that'll be for tomorrow's stream, which, by the way, I've determined to be Star Wars The Old Republic. We're going to be creating a new Jedi sage. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. I you are ridiculous. Juliet Watson. I'm flattered. Uh, of course I... Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting right, Zach, my boyfriend. <laughs> Unbelievable. Um. Would Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. Victoria. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't so... do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Okay, so Victoria's room. Where's Victoria's room? Oh, what's that? I didn't see that before. <laughs> As if. Yeah. Um, who's that? Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? So it's Victoria's room, right? Truly pathetic. Wait, I don't get it. <gasps> so I can't... Oh, hang on, let's have a look at this. Eh, eh, eh. Welcome to Black Hill. Right, where's Victoria's room? Opposite mine, okay. Hey, Eternal Flame, how's it going? Long time no see, love this game, great choice. Uh, first time playthrough. Loving it too. Thank you so much. Nice to see you, by the way. Uh, we give you one of these because we haven't seen you for a while. Hello. Hello. Good to see you, buddy. Oh, Starlix. Wait, Starlix. You lived up to your word. Hello to hello. you as well. Starlix says hello. I told you I would come along. You're absolutely 100% correct. Look at that, a man of his word. How was your evening? How was your day, buddy? I know you, uh, you'd you already gone to the zoo last time we spoke to you. Uh, was the rest of your evening okay? Are you drunk? And are you safe? That's the main thing. Great to be here. Good to have you here as well. Dude, Starlix, I've had some shocking decisions oh, man, to make. This is so wrong. I better find proof Oh, fast. there we go, Alicia. Is that Speaking the photo? Speaking of selfies... Let's play a little photo Tetris and leave Victoria a message. Let's move this here. And this one there. Wait, that looks like... Oh. Hmm, a pattern is emerging. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Give her the bird. The bird, bird, bird. Blue bird's a word. Yeah, Starlix, I've had to make some shocking decisions. Like, oh my god. Like, really... There we go. Thank you. Thanks, Alicia, for letting me know that wasn't the one I needed, too. Um, yeah, like, some decisions which have, like, major consequences. It's been so hard. My poor brain. Um, Starlick says it was so good. I am a little drunk. Glad to hear it. But coming off it, uh, just drinking water before going to sleep. Good man. Good man. Hope life is strange is good. Love the story and the characters. Yeah, I'm loving it so far. Absolutely. Totally loving it. You guys were right. Uh, no new bits there. Uh, okay, we need to find stuff. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the chase space. Color me impressed. Well, yeah. Ugh. Oh, there's a table in the way, that's why. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Thank you for your submission to the Croft Gallery. Unfortunately, your work is not compatible with our mission statement. <laughs> so, in other words, it's shit. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. Wow. 
I hate you, Victoria. Exactly. Exactly. No, officer, I'm not snooping. Just admiring Victoria's cutting edge tech. <laughs> well, we want the... We want the proof. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. That would be awesome, wouldn't it? Imagine if you had a 3D printer. Oh, yeah. They should call this series aloof. Cold and soulless. Kind of like Victoria. Ouch. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. No. No. Yes, Victoria has the best retina screen laptop. <laughs> God, Let so me just check to see if she posted my... I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Friends, 857 subs. That's so cool. This game really gets all the little um, real world, real world uh, idioms just right. Like it doesn't overdo them, um, but it makes you know it's done the whole drone thing. It does the social spaces thing. Um, does some meme stuff, and it's not in your face, but it's really cool and Boom. current. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Bitch down to Taylor. Taylor. So sad to inform you that you totally punked Juliet and Dana just now. All I had to do was mention to Juliet that I saw a nasty sext from Dana on Zach's phone. Dumbass, believe me, and so I expect there to be a dorm rampage soon. Juliet deserves this for slutting Zach away from me. As for Dana, who gives a shit? Get your popcorn. V.C. Damn, girl. You're a bitch. Um, print email. Bean Hip Cafe. Bring this ad for one dollar off. Can we take it then? <laughs> no? Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. Oh, that's him. That's the teacher. VC, very cold. Yeah, right? Victoria oh, is a real Jefferson groupie. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Whoa, that's fucked up. Missing who cares, bitch. Ooh, some serious problems going on here. I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. Uh, imagine a time when computer nerds were dumped in garbage cans and blue hair was a cause for expulsion. Male students who wore earrings were bullied and beaten. Now every football player has two to three exotic piercings. <clears throat> Oh, so it's an article basically dissing the Vortex Club. That's kind of cool. This isn't even recycled paper. Victoria's not doing her part to save the Earth. But mm. this... This mm. better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Uh, did we get something in here? Oh, and my mom. And my mom. Because the principal called. God damn it. So this is like a map of things, of places that I have to unlock, I suppose. Uh, TV. That is a tasty plasma. Maybe I could sneak in and watch <gasps> Final Fantasy Spirits Within. Oh my god, that's I don't so care cool. what anybody says, that's one of the best sci-fi films ever made. Okay, Max, I, f I think I'm falling in love with you. Uh, I watch that probably every six months. That's so funny. That's just so funny. Oh my god. Those boots Whee! are made for walking runways. Walking runways. Dior, Givenchy, you could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe. All right. All right, let's sort this out. Juliet, read this. Horse. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. 
But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Uh -huh. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zack has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Wait, how did she know I was after the flash drive? I never said that to her. I don't know what kind of people Almost play this done. game. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. That's right, they do know what type of people play this game, right? How funny. I actually do love that movie. I've got two versions of it. Uh, I've also got the um, Final Fantasy VII one. What is it? Um, Advent Children. And I never liked that, but now I've got the re... re re whatever it was version that they did so that it actually was edited differently and makes sense and it's so much better seriously um right what do we want to look at in here i can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader dramatic i guess data takes her blackwell spirit seriously sure does Ooh, dana's facebook wall is up and running I shouldn't look. <laughs> Screw that. Of um, course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. It's so fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. And yes, Max, so terribly wrong. What up, Dana? Just couch locked with Super Mario. If you want to come over, we can blaze and play or go for a walk. Let me know. <laughs> That's so funny. Um, Spirits Within was too boring to remember what happened. It wasn't bad, just not engaging. I, I, I disagree. I, I really loved it. I loved it. It's shallow, but I just loved it. It was cool. Uh, you can't say it's anywhere near as confusing as um, King's Glaive or whatever it is, the uh, Final Fantasy XV movie. Um, they know what... Uh, the, the plot thickens it does, eh? Um, to kill mine says she must have the power to read minds. Yeah, I don't know how she knew us after the um, flash drive. So that's a bit weird. It's a bit weird. Look at all the thingies. I know, right, Eldred? I am. Um, Starlux, what? You were a cheerleader for three years. It was. I quit. Was forced to when I broke my leg. Oh wow! You know, you're about the third male cheerleader I know. By the way, um, so that's really cool. Nice work. Um, Shokushuku, Advent Children was still kind of dumb with the guy turning into Sephiroth. Yeah, yeah. It's Genova Cells, not Sephiroth Cells. Yeah, I know. I mean, no amount of editing could fix it, but it was way better the second time than the first time. First time was just, I don't know what drugs they were on, right? Um, Stalic says, but I was really into the gymnastic acrobatic side to it, and I love the stunts and the flips you could do. Yeah, I bet. I bet, because it's very technical and really demanding, right? Crazy. There's that damn flash drive. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. That's right. This is both sad and pathetic. Dana, I suck at writing, but I thought I should write this so you might not hate my dumb ass forever. I know I act like a tough jock around everybody, but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I pussed out. If you need any money, let me know, Logan. Uh. It would be a cool sticker without the words. Don't know what you mean. Dana really does look stressed about all this. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Uh, Stalic says, yeah, there's a real stigma around it, such as a physically demanding... Oh, it's such a physically demanding sport, though. Uh, I did competitive cheer and went to nationals in Auckland. Shit, man, that's amazing. And Wellington. Last year, I placed third and fourth. Congratulations, dude. That's awesome. That is freaking cool. In fact, that's... Uh, that's MLG performance right there. Nice work, buddy. Damn, son. Damn, son. And yes, of course, there's going to be a stigma around it, especially in Australia and New Zealand, where the norm is sadly right down the middle of the road, white middle class uh, heterosexual folk, right? You're just <laughs> you're never going to get away from that, unfortunately. Um, Victoria. Victoria is not nice. 
I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. True I'm that. in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Oh, good. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. Uh, what? What do you mean? Oh, nothing. When you opened the flash drive, didn't you see the special folder called Max? Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Okay. There's some Pringles. Anyway, let's go and give uh Wait, so we've got the USB wait, so we need to go now, right? I think. We actually need to leave and meet Warren, I believe. Hang on. Let's meet up with Warren in the parking lot. Yep. Oh, I've got to check the drive now. Yeah, true. Um, Starlick says, My mate who did cheer with me, though, was in the f uh, first 15 rugby club, though. Oh, really? Um, he broke the norm for sure. He's such... Yeah, that's pretty cool if he's in the first 15. Definitely. Definitely. Uh, okay, so we'll go to my room and look at the drive, I guess. Whoops. I'm going to sneeze again. It <coughs> Excuse me, folks. Okay, straight to the computer, I'm guessing. Yeah. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. <laughs> Unholy obscenities. Max. Uh, what do I do? I don't know what I do here. Uh, bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you. You're all so kind. Thank you, Scarlet Karma, Ildred, Starhawk Ranger, and the boss. Uh, so how do I check out the drive? I can't... Excuse me, I can't get in there. Um, use? Daniel has so much talent. I am so... Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Uh, what am I doing wrong? I guess, do, do I just go meet him now, maybe? I mean, there's nothing else I can do in here. I'm right, gonna go to sleep now. Sounds like a plan, Starlux. Actually, I'm not far off either, to be honest. Finish my water, and I'm exhausted. I bet you are. We'll watch the VOD so I can catch up with the story and how you're finding it. Glad I could catch it live. Uh, dude, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate you stopping past. Uh, glad to hear that you're drinking up some water. Uh, and of course what that means is that you'll feel a whole lot better in the morning uh, so I hope you have a good sleep it's probably about 4 30 a.m. for you I think I think it's 4 30 a.m. so I hope you have a nice sleep in for your Sunday man uh, and continue on your great weekend and thanks for your support buddy goodbye bye bye um I yeah I don't think there's anything else I can do right I better make sure everything is still in there I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Okay, well, Not I, that I would open it no matter how tempting. I, I have myself respect. I guess we've checked that everything's there. I, I suppose that's an action. Uh, so let's go and go out to the car park, I suppose. I think this was the way out, wasn't it? Oh. I don't mind waiting here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all the cars. The more I text, the longer I take on my way. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. Poor guy's been waiting for us. Alright, they're not throwing the ball anymore. That means I need to go speak with them. Sorry, Warren. Fuck this shit. What? Ow! That hurt. I damn. I better rewind. What? What do you mean I better rewind? Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. I could almost feel sorry for him if he wasn't such a serious dick. Poor Juliet. Oh wait, so oh, I've got to talk to him before he throws the ball, maybe. Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Fuck this shit. Ow! That hurt. What? Wait, I can't change anything. <laughs> Ouch. 
Ouch, poor Alyssa. That'll leave a bruise. Wait! Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Fuck this shit! Ow! That hurt! Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Oh, uh, wait. I'll move here. Move here, maybe. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Ah, there we now go. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, I actually Hildred. helped somebody. There we go. By the way, thanks. But we're not friends. What? She texted me? Holy shit. That's unusual. What the fluff? Once I gave Juliet the proof that Victoria was behind it all, I went to get Warren's flash drive from Dana. Dana, uh, she said she was in a weird mood, but we said nasty things about Victoria, and I think it definitely made her feel better. We talked about Warren, and Dana implied he likes me. Ew. Ew. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. No problem. You have quick reflexes. Years of mad dodging skills. Bullies never change. That's why you're better off. You're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. Uh, where's the football with the... Oh, I want to get a photo of the football. Because... Uh... Look, it's this. It's that one there. Oh, maybe it's in my dorm room. Yeah, it would be, wouldn't it? Because... Oh, no. There we go. Now that's what I call instant karma. It's not my dorm room at all. Yep. Yep, yep. Okay, so we definitely missed the uh, something to do with the skateboard, right? Man, I hope I can go back. Why are you all shitty anyway? Get lost, hipster. I'm right. not doing any interviews. Whatever. Um, right, signposts. Athletic field, dorms. I always get a little giddy when I think about having my own room here. Mm. Where's the car park? Ah. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. This is creepy. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. All right, I got the photo though, so apparently I can keep that and rewind. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. Hello. I could rewind and try something different. Hello, Equinox. Good to see you. She is so retro, right? I still I get to keep the photo, right? Hey. Why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Whoa, he's a creep. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. So no keeping the photo, but... I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. <laughs> Maybe I should rewind and mind my own business? No. So even though I don't have the photo, I did the right thing, I think, anyway. You woke up late, Equinox. No worries. That's good. It's the weekend.
Work, work. <laughs> I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. Yeah, know the feeling, love. Know the feeling. Hey! You guys know what that is, right? You know what we're looking at? Let me let me remind you. Uh, have you got work, have you? There's no way I can walk to the town from here. Besides, I need to see Warren. I don't get it. How could Zack and Victoria do that to me? Juliet still looks upset about Zack and Victoria. I don't blame her. Do Aussies celebrate a St. Patrick's Day? Just curious. Um, Eternal Flame, we we do, but it's not a not a big deal. It's like Halloween here. In other words, it's not officially recognised. Um, but you know, we'll do something stupid like wear a green T-shirt for the day or drink green beer or something like that. But um, so yes, but nothing too spectacular. If that makes sense. It is the all-seeing eye indeed, Starhawk Ranger, and um, work I have says Equinox. Have a good day, buddy. Hope you do. Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Yeah, green beer. Yep, definitely. Yeah, Google it. Google it. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Exactly, disaster. Or anyway. Excuse Better to get sooner drunk. than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. Uh, you're absolutely right, Pukaki. Aussies use it as an excuse to get drunk. We don't need much of one. Elatar, forget St. Patrick's Day. It's also the feast of St. Gertrude, the patron saint of cats. Meow. Boom. Dropping the religious knowledge on you. Well, that's fully sick, mate. That is fully sick. Thank you, Elatar, for that important uh, announcement. We, we can carry on now. You mean it's not about kicking pagans out of Ireland? Oh, I'm afraid it's not that deep. Missing person poster is Warren. Uh, oh, what is going on in the background here? What's happened? Family Man 11.30 with the sub hype. Thank you so much. It's so kind of you with the prime there. Really, really appreciate that. You know what? You get some sub hype music because everything goes better with Guile. Woo, thank you with the prime sub. Snakes were a metaphor for pagans. What? Snakes, not pagans. <laughs> Sub hype from the dock there. Americans use it as an excuse to get drunk too. That's right, Ryu kid. We don't need much of one either, do we? Family man 1130. You know what? You can actually use your subprime anywhere on Twitch. And the fact that you chose to use it for me is very humbling. Um, thank you. Thank you so, so much. Really, really appreciate it, man. Hope you're enjoying the streams. And of course, you've got a whole bunch of VODs there as well if you'd like to look back. In our back I wonder catalog. how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Retarded. Um, and of course you can go to my YouTube channel where we upload every single stream if you'd like to have a, a look back into the history of the channel. I better go there soon to see if Joyce is still there. And get a burger. Sure. Good thing I don't have a car. Yet. Bike? Oh, it's being TP'd. Who toilet papers a bike? You're in a high school, Missy. What do you expect? Now this really pisses me off. So entitled. Yeah, parking. Sorry, handicapped folks. My truck needs these two spots more than you do. Bastard. Yeah, what a dick. That's I. Ooh, that makes me angry. In real life, that makes me angry. And they're exactly the sort of people as well who. If they were disabled and you parked in their spot, they'd make such a fuss, you know what I mean? That layer of dust is begging for my finger. I would not pay for my kid to go to this school, I know, right? Unfortunately, I think it's what uh, most schools are like these days, if you ask me. It's not a dirty window unless somebody writes clean me on it. You know what, Max? You rock. 
you totally rock because that's 100% correct. Uh, let's grab a photo of that. I could use this picture for a series on Arcadia Bay Lots. I'm so dirty. Okay, I just got that. I just got it just then. Um, I was going to say, pretty sure that was a photo. Okay, so we've got a sunset, we've got a sparrow or something, and we've got ah, the bloody broken skateboard, man. I hope we can get back there. Otherwise, yeah. I ruined it. Come on over here, please. Warren. Yo, buddy. What's happening? Look at Warren in his Wayback Machine. He's a brave man. Ha! <laughs> uh, um, Max, get your ass over here. Disaster says, I've pulled the winch from my truck and pulled cars out of spots if they park stupid. That's funny as. Oh my god, that's the sort of thing I would do. Uh, good on you, Disaster Piece. Shokushuko says, I don't think Come Ireland ever had Please. snakes in the first... I don't think so either. I don't think so. And yes, Disaster Piece, that's brilliant. It sure is. Good on you. <laughs> Sick burn. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Oh! Thanks. Oh! No problem. Oh, friend zoned. Check out my new wheels. Jesus, cool. poor guy. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. 60 miles? You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Um, could have done more with that time machine. Really? Damn it. Uh, I forgot what his question was. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so... That drama ended well. By the way, I saw Daniel's sketch of you online. Not bad, but I could do a much better job. Yeah, we already know he posted it online. You can draw? I thought you were blinded by science, not art. Art is science. Music is math, etc., etc. I'd put Stephen Hawking against Picasso any day. I agree with Hardcore. you. Hardcore. So you must use a computer to draw. Of course. I'd love to tweak one of your selfies with some cool graphics. That might not suck. I'll let you know. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Nicely timed, Ildred. Thank you for that. Uh, and dessert piece. Um, sorry, um, disaster piece. Dessert. See, I've got food on the mind. My apologies, disaster. I have no patience for stupidity on the road or in vehicles. Same here, buddy. It's, it just equals death. Um, and uh, lifelong pain and suffering. So, yeah. I agree. Uh, look at the bird on the car roof next to them. Yeah. Oh, is that a photo opportunity? Ah, oh, it is too. You're right. Thank you so much. Um, and yes, of course, RIP. Stephen Hawking. Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone, which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. <laughs> ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. In no way. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Um, yeah, I think so as well. Hang on, let's just check, check. I look at the bird on the car roof next to them. It looks like the picture it does, but uh, I think um, you're right, 92 Moo. And by the way, hello to you. I don't think we've met before, so um, Lionel's got something to say to you, buddy. Hello. There you go, hello. Thanks for stopping along, by the way. Appreciate it very much. Um, I think I missed this photo probably because I've triggered the cutscene, right? Um, I reckon. What? javonchi has gone as well, Scarlet. When, when, when did that happen? When did that happen? Um, squirrel freezes and points. <gasps> nope, and hello. 92. Good to see you, buddy. 
Um. How so? Sensitive usually means won't be having sex with you. Oh God, you need a sensitive woman to kick your ass. <laughs> if I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. Oh God, these decisions. Uh, let's a let's that's a beaver over the kids' shoulder. No, it's a it's a parrot. I mean, not a parrot. I need to go to bed. By the way, we've just hit exactly three hours for the stream. Uh, so we're going to wind it down very shortly. It's a sparrow or whatever it is. It's a bird. It's not not a squirrel. How many whiskeys have you had this evening, Alatar? What are you seeing? How many birds do you see? Um, I'm going to go to bed. It's 1.50. See you guys. Sambo and chat. To kill mine, thank you for coming along, buddy. Thank you so much. Um, you're not going to miss much. We're going to wind down the stream any minute now, anyhow. So thanks for sticking with it. And I hope you enjoyed it, man. Thanks for your hints and tips as well. Um, Scarlet Karma says Javonchi passed away on the 10th. Shit, I didn't even know that. Wow. Um, confide or not? Squirrel is behind the blue car. Oh, is it really? Okay. I need to talk to somebody. It's a pigeon! Just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me. Not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. Hey. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal? Now. Answer me, bitch! Shit! Okay, this escalated quickly. Alright, fuck you, you prick. I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Um, this escalated very quickly. Steph, good night. See you tomorrow, I hope. Have a great uh, sleep. Um, with your crazy sleeping hours there. Uh, who is that? What happened in the background there? Sorry, I was caught up in the story there. 92 Moo! Thank you so much for the follow, man. That's Thank really, you. really kind of you. Uh, and by the way, uh, follows mean a lot here. You, you're the best. You guys are the best. For a small streamer like me, the more followers I have, the better. Trust me. Uh, and I do appreciate it. Thank you so much. Um, now, do we just say take a step back or I could call the police? I could call the police. Do it! The Prescotts own the pigs here. Get away from her, dude! <gasps> hey! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait, in the bathroom! No. <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Go! Go! I got this! Yeah, beat Get him up! Max. Jeepers. Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! Holy shit! Go Warren, right, Alicia? Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Chloe, hi! Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? I agree with you, Elitar. In a way, it's like, so they leave the other kid there getting his ass beat even though they were armed with a truck. Yeah, I know. I hope they... Why didn't they... They should be calling the police right now. 
Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? <laughs> Who did that? What have you done, by the way, Scarlet? Now we'll have to lose focus of the game. We'll allow that. Uh, what did you say? Is that bad that I wish Max had kicked him in the nuts? Not at all. I would have kicked him in the nuts as well. Definitely. Definitely. I don't think running over the rich kid works. Yes, that's true. Security guard ran up as they were driving off. True, 92 Moo. That's true, actually. That's true. Um, I can't remember what she said. What was her question? Does anyone remember what her question was? God damn it, I've forgotten already. I'm going to wait to see if anyone remembers what the question was. What am I answering? I'm so tired. I need to go to bed. It's 3 a.m. Uh, the security guard. Yeah, do you guys know? Or at least tell me just which one do I answer, left or right? I think it's if she came back for the school. <laughs> Shamed. I think it's if she came back for the school or not. Yeah. Um, well, yeah, I did. I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely out of my week. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. Yeah. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Um, this is more fun. Just tell... Just let it run and see if they drive to the other side of the country waiting. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, I think everybody missed it. I don't know why. It was weird, eh? It was something about Seattle. Yeah, I think so too, Scarlet. I think we're okay with that answer we did, though. Uh, it's if she liked the new city. Oh, thank you, 92 Moo. If Seattle was better than Arcadia Bay. Oh, shit. Oh, well. Of course. It's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Oh, ouch. Everyone was occupied with the fight. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I reckon too, Moo. I reckon too. Um, yeah, I mean, I feel like saying giving a, give her a break, but... Or... I wanted to. I was just so tripped out over leaving Arcadia. Oh, please. I'm sure your phone and laptop were frozen in time. You're merciless. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. No That's sense. true. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Ouch! That didn't go well. Can't rewind. Cereal? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Nerd alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. <laughs> Welcome home, Max. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home.
Looks so good, doesn't it? My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Medicate? Uh, I'm sorry, I drunk texted those naked pictures to your mom. Yeah, you never have the right conversation options in these games. Because that's totally what would happen, right? Um, Chloe has a point. Yeah, Ildred. I reckon. 92 moves. This is one of those scenes that plays out the same no matter what you choose. Ah, oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Guess who the stepdad is, though? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Step douche. When's the last time I had to dig through Chloe's crap? Uh, wow. She's got an American flag up there. A missing... P God, there's a whole bunch of stuff here, isn't there? Um, and you know what this means? Uh, you guys are going to hate me, probably. Uh, what a beautiful view that is. I think this is a good spot. You guys are totally going to hate me, but I am freaking exhausted, and it is time for me to hit the sack. Uh, this has been absolutely incredible. I've, I've totally loved playing this game. You guys, what a good suggestion, by the way. Uh, we've been streaming for 3 hours and 10 minutes, and it's probably a good time to take a break. I don't know how far through episode 1 we are, but I'm just absolutely adoring this game. Uh, well, it is 3 a.m., so I guess it's time to bring out the glow sticks, Hildred. Oh, am I nearly at chapter 292? Yeah, 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 the truck scene. Yeah, I know what you mean. I guess she's not into Blue's Clues or Teletubbies anymore. Blue's Clues. Are we nearly close? I'm so glad you like it. It's a great... Oh, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Um, 92, I'm exhausted. Uh, how close exactly are we? Do you know? Uh, you really... You're nearly at chapter two. Like, how close? Like, I mean, a couple of conversations past her. I uh, hope you're ready for it to get dark. I keep hearing that, right? I keep hearing that. That it's like this big setup and then it, like, dumps you in it. Uh, and it's quite hard hitting. Uh, a couple of tasks. Oh, yeah, no, no, I need to get... I'll, I'll do that next time. This has been awesome. And it's not an excuse to leave. I'm just falling asleep and it's been a long day. Uh, but I've loved it so far. It feels like a good beat in the story to let it go it feels like i'm about to well i mean i've just caught up with chloe and we're about to talk with her so that's like a whole new branch of things as far as my character's concerned so there we go yorick just as just good timing we're just heading off <laughs> but good morning to you as well good to see you by the way um you have a bit to go still i'd Chloe's say wait if you're tired yep i better look for a cd i uh, i do need to head away i do need to head away um, exit to the main menu, yes please. Uh, that's okay, I think it's saved on the way in there. Um, this has been unbelievably awesome. Um, I can't believe I didn't play this game sooner. Why have I owned this game for like two and a half years and, and basically never touched it? I'm an idiot. Um, Talon says, thanks for the stream Sambo. I've forgotten how good this game is. It's my absolute pleasure. Thank you guys for coming along. I really appreciate it. Uh, make sure you get some sleep then. Absolutely, Yorick. Absolutely. Good to see you though, buddy. Hope you're having an awesome day. Uh, Pukaki says, good night. Good night to you too, my friend. Thanks for sticking with us. Uh, when are you on next? We're on in about 10 hours. Uh, so 1 p.m. Australian time or 1.30, depending on how busy I am. Uh, and we're going to be playing some Star Wars The Old Republic tomorrow. So, yeah, look forward to that. We'll start off a brand new Jedi Sage human. Because uh, it's been a good, what, three or four years since we've played that with Tallahassee. So, we'll, uh, just do a bit of a bit of a temperature check. Check in with the game and see how it's going. I played a bit of it earlier tonight and it seemed quite cool. Uh, I definitely will enjoy it more rested, I think, Starhawk Ranger. I'm absolutely falling asleep. So, um, Scarlet, get some rest. See you next time. Same to you. Thanks for the stream. Rest well, says Alicia. Thank you so very much. Uh, you needed your Sambo fix. Well, I hope, hope you got your dosage of it, Starhawk Ranger. Uh, my pleasure, Ashley. Great to see you as always. Thank you for your support with the um, Tier 3 sub uh, emoticons there, um, the emotes. Thank you so much, buddy. I, I do. I have a little thing which tells me about all of my subs all the time, so don't worry, you guys are never far from my mind, and I never take it for granted. Thank you so much. Uh, back to Spring Festival for you, Starhawk. Oh, yes, in Lotro. It's a gorgeous ceremony. I love that event. It's so cool. Yada Swotor says, Bogaris, you'll be seeing it very, very soon. 
Good night, Ashley. Uh, Ildred, good night to you as well. Disaster piece. Does Tallahassee still play with you on stream? No. No, he doesn't. Thank not you really. for the stream. Uh, let me see. Who's that? Ildred88 has used the 100 biddies. Thank you for the stream. Thank you for the bits, Thank man. You. you guys totally are the best. You know it, right? You totally know it. And it's my pleasure. Thank you for the support. I will be spending your biddies tomorrow at Starbucks. Oh, I can't wait. I could almost, almost go for a coffee right now, but we'll wait till the morning, of course. Um, so, um, oh, I need to, uh, I also need to mute that one. Whoopsie, sorry about that. We're getting a mess of sounds there. My bad. Anyway, that's it. I need to go to bed. Thank you once again, guys. Really, really do appreciate it. Hope you had an awesome time, and I hope to catch you on the next stream. Have a great day. It's the weekend. Enjoy, relax, and we'll see you soon. Good night.